Hi Aries, how are you doing my loves? Thank you so much for tuning in. This is going to be a general reading to see who or what is coming towards you in love. Please take the messages however they resonate for you. They can be interchangeable, meaning, you know, if I say something, it doesn't sound like you, it is the person that you are dealing with. These are general readings, they're not meant to be, you know, fit your situation to the T, but for the majority of you, it tends to, right? Um, so yeah, if you do need a, uh, a precise reading, you can head over to my website, prettyintuitivetarot.com. I do have affordable prices. This could be something happening now in the near future or the future. The readings are timeless. Let's get it, do it. <laughs> I'm excited to do you guys this reading. It's always fun. Who or what's coming towards the Aries collective and love, please, spirit. And I'm an Aries Venus, so I'm just like, ah, I'm gonna let me trade it. She was going on here. I feel like that is like way too much smoke. I don't need that much damn smoke. Or we could just put it over here instead. I'll just put it, just move that over there. Too much smoke over here. Who or what is coming towards that? Oh, that's Terry's. Are you guys doing what it said? Who or what is coming towards Aries and love, please? Aries, Aries, Aries. Ooh. All right, Aries. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra, but you have the nurture card. This is the Empress. Who or what is coming towards Aries and love? Aries. Aries. Who what is coming towards them in love? Thank you, spirit. All right, so you have strengthening bonds. This is the Ace of Pentacles. And you have just breathe, which is the Four of Swords. And then at the bottom, oh, man, that is so dope. Here you are. Here you show up. This is the Emperor card. You could be dealing with another Aries. Eight of Wands, communication. Love abounds, the Ace of Cups. Okay. I like it. I'm feeling it. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Who or what is coming towards them in love, please? Tap me into their higher self spirit. Thank you so much. Who or what is coming towards Aries, Collective, and Love? Aries. Oh. All right, Aries. So... You have past life relationship. Ooh, soulmate and a new love. Okay. Damn, I'm feeling it. <laughs> so are you telling me that you guys are dealing with like um, a soulmate and a new love? Some, some of you could just be dealing with a new person. That's it. This person is a soulmate. You do share past life relationship with this person, whoever the heck this person needs you. So bottom of the deck is chemistry. with a Virgo. Aquarius. Gemini. Leo. Leo. All right. Mm, someone, you know, this is the full card. New adventures, new journey, starting fresh, starting over, getting to know somebody. Let's see. Who or what is coming towards the Aries Collective and Love, please, Spirit? Show me what I need to see for Aries. Aries. Who is coming towards them? Aries. Somebody wants to come and see you. This person could be at a distance from you. Maybe you have never um, seen this person. And for some of you, if this is a new person, maybe you met them online or something and you're, you haven't seen them yet, but they can't wait. They're very excited to see you, Aries. You have the Ace of Swords. I feel like this is someone that you have a lot in common with. Like you feel excited. This person makes you feel excited. 
and they're they they you could be a little dealing with a cancer but it's like um they're starting to feel like they're falling in love with you but it's on a subconscious level okay remember the queen of cups she tends to be very dreamy okay it's like she's trying to really understand what is going on here if you take a look at that cup you know she's just very mesmerized by the cup this person is like enamored by you they just feel really um like they're they're feeling sweet on you <laughs> All right, for some of you, this is definitely um, a past person coming into your life. You're going to have a past person and a new person. They both could be soulmates. Ain't that some shit? Who you going to do there? You got the three of wands. One of them could be at a distance from you, long distance, you know, in another country. But oh, this person really wants to see you. They really want to see you. Page of Wands, they're definitely going to invite you out. They want to have a face-to-face -face conversation. Like, they want to see you in person, whether they're new or old. And they're excited. They can't wait. They're excited. They can't wait to see you again, Aries. Um, if this is someone from the past that you haven't seen in a long time, shit, they're coming in. They're going to invite you out soon. They want to meet up. They want to meet up. That's why that fool energy was here. Whoever this person is, they're super excited about you. You make them feel like giddy. <laughs> you make them just feel like so alive and just, I don't know, Aries. What are you doing to them? Just clarify the three of wands. You make them feel really excited. Why is the page with three of wands here? <clears throat> okay. Oh, the page of wands here again. Yeah. So be dealing with an Aquarius, but this person seems like they're they're um they could be a bit far away from you and they want to meet up with you. They do. Um, something is definitely coming to an end here. Aries, if you have been, you know, feeling like you just you know, you're looking for that one. You're not really looking for it, Aries, but you've been waiting to meet that special person. They're coming in. That's what I feel. They are coming in if you have not met them already. Wow. Clarify the Ace of Swords. This is someone that you're really um, going to be able to, for those of you who aren't fucking with the old, okay, and you want the new, I do see new love coming into you as well. This is someone who is going to be very smart. They're intellectual. Someone that you can really have um, stimulating conversations with. This is someone that is like you're, it's, it's, it's like-minded. You guys are like-minded. You guys think the same. It's like, it, you guys just click. There's a lot of chemistry here. That's why chemistry is here. It's like you guys click. Click. And the nine of wands, definitely a card of travel, okay? So this person wants to see you, Aries. Clarify the ace of swords. And I also feel a past person is going to try to come. They're going to try to reunite with you. They want to see you as well. Shit. What are you going to do? Yeah, I see this person's like a soulmate. Maybe you've been feeling um stuck like a bad luck. Like you, not bad, well, bad luck. I was like, you feel like you're kind of stuck in a rut. Like you're not really lucky in love or you just, it just doesn't work out for you and but I see that turning around, Aries. I'm seeing like a new love coming into your life very soon. That's going to be a soulmate. You will share a past life relationship with this person. And I also feel like a past person is going to emerge as well. Ooh, that's exciting. Someone really has their eye on you. They just have a lot of passion for you. They just, damn. You got the sun, this Leo energy here. My goodness. Clarify the Knight of Wands. <clears throat> this is someone with this Empress card. Somebody who really wants to, uh, it's like they want to take you out and wine and dine you. And just, even if you're a man, like this woman, she just wants to like nurture you and just treat you like a king. Mm. Let's clarify the Knight of Wands. Just getting an, an energy of, of someone that just wants to uh, make you feel good. But some of you could be worried that this person is a player because you're like, why are you so nice? You know, like, it's kind of like you're worried that this person could be um, not who they say they are or like they're playing you. 
So you you have you're you're a little anxious. You're a little anxious. You know what I'm saying? You you're a little anxious. You know. You got your little eye on them. You like yeah right motherfucker. Mm hmm. I'm watching you closely, player. But Aries, I don't get a vibe that this person is like a player. Hmm. I don't really get that energy that they're a player. All right. Let's clarify the page of wands. What is the page of wands spirit for Aries? This person that is coming towards them in love. What is the page of wands? What is the page of wands? All right. The page of wands is temperance. in the... For some of them, they might like invite you out for a drink. And that's going to be, <laughs> that's going to be their way of reuniting with you, Aries. If this is someone from the past that maybe you used to have a drink with, or you know that they drink, they're going to invite you over for like a drink. They might invite you over like, hey, would you like to come over? Or um, like for some of them, they could be having like an event at their house or their family could be having some sort of event and they might invite you. That's what I'm picking up. Because like I said, Page of Wands, it's, it's, hey, what's up? You want to meet up? That's what it is. So expect some sort of communication from this um, past person. And I do see a new love coming in towards you too. You have the Page of Cups as well. And you have the Page of Pentacles, okay? So that is definitely an invite. It's nothing big. It's nothing big. Like, you know, we doing it big. It's a little, it's the Page of Pentacles. Like, hey, let's meet up at Starbucks for a coffee. Or um, would you like to go... Shit, I don't know. Go get a McChicken at McDonald's real quick. What you want to do? <laughs> so they're going to try to like, you know, this is kind of similar to Sagittarius reading. Could be connected to a Sagittarius because I did make that mistake of saying your name. I mean, their name. Why is the four of wands here? For a small percentage of these people, they may have been a player in the past when you were talking to them. But now they're really starting to see that you are the one. It's almost like they've woken up with the seven of cups in reverse. They, they have woken up and they see that, I mean, I mean, there's no one like you. I got to go get my Aries back. And they're taking action. They're taking swift, significant action, Aries. Woo! Because wherever the hell they went to, whatever they went ahead and, go, and gone and did, it just wasn't pleasant. So they're coming back. See, wherever they went to, if they left you, they walked away, they're coming right on back. And, and, and I'm talking about very soon. I'm talking about within the next. I know these readings are timeless, but I'm picking up on times like at least by the end of August, early September. I mean, someone is really taking action here. And they want to come see you. They want to spend time with you. This new person this could, um, this new person's also going to want to see you as well. Damn. Clarify the Queen of Cups. Clarify the Queen of Cups for Aries, please. <laughs> God damn. Knight of Wands. That motherfucker just keeps showing up. The hangman. So, Aries, this may have somewhat... This this may have been someone who left you in the cold. Maybe they abandoned you or they ghosted you. They detached from you. You maybe haven't heard from the from this person in a while. Things have been on hold. Maybe, like I said um, a few minutes ago, this person in the past, maybe were they were noncommittal or they were acting as if they didn't really want you or some shit, okay? But I am getting vibes that this person was a player in the past or that they were doing some shit, acting indecisive, you know, noncommittal, hangman. Um, higher fin here. It was up in the air. But now they're really starting to see that they want a commitment with you, Aries. They're starting to see that, you know, this is where it's at. And and they're they're coming in. They're ready to fight for this. They're ready to they're charging forward here, Aries. Because I mean, they're just absolutely enamored by you. They've been thinking and they're done thinking. They're not trying to do that thinking no more. They're taking action here. They just can't stop. Queen of Cups. They're in love with you. Not the new person, of course, but I mean, this past person. They're in love with you. They just can't, they can't help it. And they're coming. Ooh. <gasps> Woo! 
they're coming, Aries. They're up. They are coming. Told you. A lot of knights and knights and pages. They they do deliver messages. They do take action. So it's expected. It's coming very soon. This is not no knight of pentacles energy. This is very soon, very soon, very quick, out of the blue, unexpected. Ace of Cups here. For some of them, they might want to let you know that they love you if they never told you that before. They want to tell you that now. With the Empress, I mean, this person is really starting to see you as, you know, someone that they could make their wife or someone that they could be married, um, married to and committed to. That's what they want from you. They want a commitment. They want to strengthen the bond, Aries. They do want to strengthen the bond. They want to hang out. The Four of Swords, to me, is also a card of... Um, like, let's hang out, you know, let's just spend some time together is what I'm picking up. Yeah. Let's see. Aries. All right. This is for Aries. Can I have any more messages for this person? It's coming towards Aries. Who are what's coming towards Aries, please? Who are what's coming towards Aries in love, please? <gasps> oh, okay, okay, okay. Yep, here it is, Aries. I'm telling you, can I have one more card? Who or what's coming towards the Aries collective in love? Ooh. Oh, okay. That's a lot of messages. All right, Aries, I'm telling you, somebody, um, they're ready to take that step. It's like you have the key to this person's heart. They're ready to take that step. You're a woman. Yeah, they really um want to make you their woman, make you their lady. They're gaining the courage to come in and, 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 and just take you off the market. That's what they're doing here, Aries. It's like, I don't know how to describe this shit. This person is, take, is taking serious action here. Maybe this person was um, passive before. They were passive. They nonchalant and it, it might be come as a shock to you to see this person act this way to be so like bold they're gonna be very bold with you like they're gonna just tell you what they they're gonna be bold with you nice yeah <clears throat> you know if you are um yeah they so some of them they want to take a trip with you they want to do something with you i'm telling you they're planning some type of invite you over some type of event that that's what they want to do aries like i said if you're a woman you know i do see a new man coming into your life okay new and old new and old i'm telling you if you're a man i do see a new woman coming into your life new or old doesn't matter both actually both of them so <laughs> this should be exciting aries right it should be exciting for what comes towards the aries collective and love please messages yeah, this person misses you, Aries. They watch your social media. Who are what's coming towards you, Aries of love, please? Messages. Maybe this person had was too prideful in the past. They were prideful in the past. I keep my distance because I'm afraid of getting hurt. Yeah, maybe that's for some of you that, that was the case for this person. One more message for Aries. Who or what's coming towards the Aries collective and love people? One more message. about our sex all the time all right we're not gonna get into that we're not gonna get into that but some of them that's exactly what they've been thinking about they just can't get you off their mind they want some more of that loving all right so aries um i think i'm gonna go ahead and extend this video as well i think i did one for sagittarius i'm gonna extend this video because i'm curious to see like if you give this person a chance you know what what's gonna come of this what are they really after? Because it seems like they really want you back. What are they really after? Are you really in love? Right? So, thank you so much, Aries, for tuning in. I hope to see you guys back at my channel. I love you all.
Oh yeah, let me let me get one of these cards too. Let's come to Aries. Aries, what what? Sorry, I'm coming to us. <clears throat> Too many damn cards. All right, so Aries, the real deal. So who does this person sees you as the real deal? And I do see a lot of you meeting the one soon. If, if you don't want this past person back, I see you meeting the one soon. Like, the one. Realize your light. Yeah, somebody is realizing now that, you know, you are it. I don't know where the fuck, what type of crack they were smoking before, because they didn't see it before, obviously. And they're and they're just missing you. They're, they're coming in. Some of them maybe had money issues. Trust issues. God, I leave. They had a bunch of shit going on. Anyway, love you, Aries. See you guys later. Thank you.